Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back once again with the Atom Stack A5 M50 Pro. Friends, today we're going to use the offline controller, so let's get cracking. All right, friends. So, once again, we are in Lightburn. I've got it set to line mode. We're doing 2000 for our speed, 100 for our power, and we are doing six passes to cut through this cardboard. Now I have plugged in the USB stick, I've got the little SD card in it, and we are going to save the G code. Notice it already went to that drive for me. I've got it named Ghost. I'm gonna just save over top of it so you can see how it works. Yes, I wanna replace it. Of course, friends, once you're done with that, don't forget to eject it safely. And friends, let's take it over to the laser cutter. All right, friends, so I'm gonna power it on. Let's put in the SD card. Notice it was the wires facing forward. Real quickly, that's what the interface is going to look like. But let's get our cardboard set up first. We'll loosen this. Let's grab our gauge and get it in there. Tighten it down. I'm going to just move my cardboard to where I want. On the interface, we're going to hit Carve. We're going to pick the one we want, and we want that cute little ghost file. I'm going to manually move the laser. There is a tiny red dot being shown so you can see where you're at. I'm going to pick this spot is where I want to make it. So I'm going to now tell it, hey, that's my position, and yes, it was successful. Now I'm going to hit Frame. You can see the laser tracing where it's going to be. I'm not sure if you guys can see the beam, but I can see the beam. It's going to be fantastic. Of course, this is scrap material. So now I am going to grab my glasses, and we're going to simply hit print. It says, how many times do you want to do it? Well, I know I had my six passes already recorded, so I'm just going to tell it yes. If you did hit two, it would do 12 passes. And friends, just like that, you are laser cutting without being connected to a computer. I'm gonna hit yes, it's done. Let's pull out our design and check it out. We have got an awesome tiny cardboard ghost. How cool is that? Friends, I gotta tell you, I am totally impressed with the Atom Stack A5 M50 Pro. Being able to do this offline controlling is so slick. Once you've got a design set up, you can just come back and reuse it. It is a fantastic feature to have in your laser cutter. Friends, of course, if you're looking for more information, I will have links down below. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, if you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Or smash that subscribe button and last but not least hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.